This is Millie Weaver, and we are here at CPAC 2020. President Trump just got finished with his speech. He did some pretty hilarious things where he crouched low at the microphone at the podium to make fun of Bloomberg. But uh, she was really mean to Minnie Mike. I'll tell you, the way she treated him. He didn't know what hit him. He's going, oh, get me off of this stage. President Trump's speech just got out. Let's talk to some of the people to see what they thought about it. Hi there. What did you guys think of President Trump's speech? Oh, it was fantastic. Just fantastic. I mean, what was the best part? Well, he, he is so comical, you know. He just has a way of saying things that just really get the crowd moving, but, but you can connect with. Definitely. Thank you so much. All right, let's talk more. Hi. Hi there, hi! What did you guys think of President Trump's speech? It was phenomenal. It was absolutely phenomenal. And it was just so energetic. And his energy is so admirable. And just the fact that he can get a whole room on their feet yelling, USA in four more years is just outstanding and phenomenal. And I wanted to thank you as well. You're the one who got me into politics, actually. Awesome. Thank, yeah, you. I'm, thank you. I'm glad you got yes. involved. Thank, yes. you. thank you. Hi so there. Much. What did you think about President Trump's speech? You know what, I think it was one of the best speeches he has ever given. This is my second time at CPAC, so he got everything perfectly, everything succinct. Um, last year he went on a little bit, but you know, I, I'm never tired of listening to the president, but this time was perfect. Do you feel confident that he'll win in 2020? I do. I, I think we'll get another four more years. Thank you so much. We love Hi. watching you all the way from Germany. Hi. How are you? It's great to You're see good. you. I Thank watch you, you always on here. all your uh, podcasts, and wow, fantastic. Awesome. So what do you think about President Trump's speech? Well, How I was think it? it's fantastic, and it's great that they talk about socialism. I live in a socialist country of Germany, and I see the downsides of it. And uh, it's great to be here and the Americans need to realize what it means, social medicine, where you wait four to five months for a doctor's appointment, and these are the things that the people really need to know. They're only talking about it. I have to actually live it, so I see the difference. And uh, yeah, it was a great speech. Um, I believe in my heart. Of course, 99% of the Germans hate the administration, but- So you think he's the best president, right? <laughs> He's the best president for this country that we've ever seen. And he does, and I believe my heart, he does everything for the American people. That's what's gonna make him and keep America great. And I am happy to see you too. And thank you for all your work. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. I, there. What did you think about President Trump's speech? How was it? I thought it was absolutely fabulous. It was it was like two hours of stand-up comedy, but in well, between it was in between you had all the facts about everything that he's done for this country. And uh, you know the women really love him. I am the uh, founder and president of Virginia Women for Trump. I have thousands and thousands of followers. This is the director of uh, Pennsylvania Women for Trump. We're grassroots, not official. Yes. And you know, you would not believe how many women that contact me from all over the country, and I've raised up groups in other states. So, so, so he's getting the women involved. Oh That's great. God, well, thank yes. you so much, ladies. Thank, thank, you. You. thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Hi there. Hi, how are you? What do you think of Trump's speech? How was it? We loved it. Great. It was great. What was the best part? The best part? Yeah. Well, the grand finale, of course. <laughs> yeah. What was that? The speech. The speech, speech yeah. yeah. sure, sure. Awesome. Great Thank time. you, guys. Thanks. Hi, sir. What do you think of President Trump's speech? Phenomenal. Better than it was last year. It was great. great. What was the best part? What did you like the most? For me, probably the funniest thing that he did was when he imitated <laughs> Minnie Mike by going down, <laughs> but that was hysterical. That was hysterical, but it was typical Trump and I loved it, every bit of it. It was great, it was great. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. Hey guys, what do you think of Trump's speech? It was amazing. I think it's one of the best speeches he's ever given. Yeah. What was your favorite part? Um, I think my favorite part was when he talked about the farmers because I'm a rancher myself, so I thought that was pretty cool that he's doing a lot for us, so. Yeah. So you think so? He's helped you a lot. 
Yeah, he has. And, you know, he talks about, like, the struggles that farmers and ranchers face temporarily. But I think, you know, we have to think long term. And in the long term, I think it's going to work out great for us. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you. Thank God. Thanks, guys. All right. Hi there. Hi. What do you think of President Trump's speech? How oh, was it? Absolutely. I knocked it out of the park. Fantastic. What was the best part? I would say when he went off script and, you know, he was really himself and when he shows that he uh, is really enjoying this job despite the fact that it is, he's taking so much abuse. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you so much. Hi there. What was the best part of Trump's speech? Um, the spirit in the audience, in the crowd. Thank you. How was, how was Trump's speech? It was amazing. How can you get any better than that? The energy is palpable. Trump's at the top of his game. What was the best moment? Oof, the best. I got to say, when he started shrinking down, talking about Mini Mike. Mini Mike, I mean, you know, he got destroyed. Uh, Pocahontas just, it can be a little brutal at times, but, you know, you got to have a little fun at the same time of being yeah. serious. And I think that was the best moment. Is awesome. When he pulled that out. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. Hi, sir. What was your favorite part of Trump's no, speech? No, no, no. You can't Everything. Talk. Everything. Everything. All right. Hey guys, what was the best part of Trump's speech? Uh, uh mini Mike. Yeah. Or uh, you know, well, you know, I'm I don't know. I'm a pollster, so he slammed pollsters and even I was laughing. That was funny stuff. Yeah. That was fun. It's he's right. He's right. They lie a lot. Awesome. Stuff. Thank you guys. Thanks Thank so you. much. Thank you. Hey. hey. What do you think of Trump's speech? Love him. Oh I love God. him. He's the best. He is the best. He gets us pumped. He's the right person for the job for four more years. We love you, Trump. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. So, yeah. well, you had been in his rally all the way. We are from Pennsylvania and New Jersey, so every time he goes to the state, we go. We have pictures with him. Awesome. Four more years. Thank you, four ladies. Hi. Hi. What do you think of Trump's speech? It was absolutely incredible, so inspiring and motivating. Honestly, just makes me want to go back out into my community and really work hard to help my state continue to stay red and share conservative beliefs and values with my community at school at Arizona State. Awesome. Thank, yes, thank you. Thank you so much. Really? Thanks so much. All right. Hi there. Hi. Ricky Hi. Rebel. Ricky Rebel. Hi. What do you think of Trump's speech? Oh, my gosh. I loved it. I'm, I'm so inspired by this speech. I thought it was much more, like, uh, sensitive, actually, and mature. Like, he's matured. He's like a seasoned president now. He has, hasn't he? Yeah. He has. He's done so great. Well, I'm going to be signing off here, guys, but check back for more videos. This is Millie Weaver signing off. Remember, I'm listener supported, so please go to InfoWarsStore.com to support my work. Take advantage of some of the great deals and the great products we have available so you can both help take care of your own health and help us fight the Info War. You can also go to Millie Weaver on Subscribestar to support me directly if you choose to. Thank you so much, and I can't wait to give you my next video. When it comes to rebuilding your energy, convenience is key. While coffee, candy, and other sugary products can give you a short boost, the crash can leave you more tired than ever. Turbo Force from InfoWars Life is a powerful mix-in energy packet that utilizes vitamins, amino acids, and extracts used for hundreds of years to provide you focus, clarity, and a boost of energy on the go. Simply take a packet, mix it into the indicated amount of water, and enjoy. With 14 servings per box for a two-week or more supply, this is the formula to stock up on whenever you need a boost. Perfect for work, in the car, or at home. Turbo Force is the ultimate answer to a sluggish day. Don't let your day slow you down. Perk up with Turbo Force at InfoWarsStore.com.